Hello, and welcome to this week's screencast. My name is Spencer, aka Island Dog. And for this episode, I wanted to take you through a brief tour of Object Doc Plus. Now, there is a free version of Object Doc available, which is a dock for your Windows desktop. But this is the Plus version that obviously has uh, some more features above the Plus version. Uh, this is $20, and it's uh, well worth it, as this is definitely one of the top three applications I have on my desktop at all. One of the big features of the Plus version, and, and my favorite, is the ability to have tab docs. Um, as you can see here, to keep my desktop pretty clutter-free, I'll uh, organize my dock into different sections for different applications or even websites. And uh, as an example here on the main one, I, I have my uh, weather docklet, which is a little mini application. And that'll give me a, a flyout forecast for the next week. And there's also ones for uh, searching like Google, um, battery meters. There, there, there's all types available. Um, and like I said, just uh, adding shortcuts is just easy as dragging them, dropping them right on the dock. You can also right click and add entries. And one of those would be a flyout menu, which is really cool because you can set it up. Let's see, I'll set it up for to look at my documents just real quick you can also customize the icons and all that stuff too and you see here I'll just click this one and it's going to give me a flyout of my of my documents folder and we can just keep going all the way till we get down to the individual file and we can click and open that file itself it's pretty handy especially if you have a, a big file hierarchy I also have a section for all my uh, commonly used applications, uh, graphics applications, uh, keep all my office stuff in one location. Uh, it makes it all easy to find, makes it really easy to get to, saves a lot of time during the day. Uh, I have one for all my Stardock applications. And you can pick and choose, you can rename the categories, you can colorize them, there's all kinds of different options. And another feature of the Plus version is the ability to add a system tray uh, tab to it. You see here it has all the uh, applications running and they're displayed in my dock. And this is really good because you can uh, actually eliminate the Windows taskbar and just use Object Dock for pretty much everything. Because it also has a really cool feature and this is available in the free version I believe as well. You can create your own start menu. And clicking here it will display your full start menu. And it even, it'll even take on, if you're using window blinds, it'll even take on that scheme you're using. It's very handy for a taskbar replacement for Windows. And Object Dock has a bunch of, of uh, customization options as well. In the configuration here, we can go to the tabs and styles. And uh, it comes with several uh, styles, themes installed. But you can see there's... Uh, hundreds of themes available to download on WinCustomize.com. Uh, many of them are made to match window blind skins so it's easy to match up your themes with your dock. And you can allow color and, and to even customize it even more. You can change the color. You can also adjust the fonts used. And you can easily add tabs and remove them, rearrange them, all that stuff from here as well. Uh, the docklets, like we talked about before, the little mini applications on the desktop, uh, weather, web search, battery, clocks, calendars, all that stuff. You can add those uh, from here as well. And you can get more information about uh, Object Doc Plus, and you can also download the free version of Object Doc from uh, objectdoc.com.